More lawnmower manufacturers are touting speed as a selling point for ride-on tractors. Ever wonder which are actually faster? Consumer Reports pitted two popular ride-on mowers against each other in a grass-cutting face-off. The course? Two identical 6,000 square foot plots of land with four and a half inches of grass to cut and one determined rider for each. Consumer Reports outdoor equipment tester, Peter Sawchuk. The goal? To go as fast as we can and still get a nice cut. A challenge since Consumer Reports tests have found going too quickly can result in the equivalent of a bad haircut. The contestants? In this corner, a classic. The $1,800 John Deere D125 lawn tractor with a top speed of five miles per hour. Its opponent? the $2,600 Toro Time Cutter ZTR with a top speed of seven miles per hour. Both are equipped with a 42 inch cutting deck. We used a stopwatch to time Peter's start and finish times. The John Deere plowed through the course at about four miles per hour. Keep in mind that Consumer Reports tests have found an ideal cutting speed is about three and a half miles per hour. The John Deere finished in a respectable 12 minutes and 54 seconds. The Toro ZTR zipped through in just under nine minutes at about five miles per hour. Both tractors mowed pretty evenly given the higher speeds, but not so fast. Take a look at this. Both mowers left clumps of grass throughout each plot. If you go too fast, you're going to create clumping. You're just taking more grass into that deck than it can handle and it comes out in clumps. With the John Deere, there were too many clumps for Peter to judge it as an acceptable cut. So he solved that by making a second pass over the lawn. The clumping with the Toro wasn't as bad, but go too fast and you get tire marks. It left behind several on our plot. When you go to make a turn, those tight turns, uh, you turn quickly, but you tear up the turf with the wheels when you do that. So fast isn't always better, but it is something to consider when you have a large piece of property. What faster helps is when you get from one end of your property to the other. For efficiency's sake, Peter says the best way to mow your lawn is to go around the perimeter of your property two times then go back and forth in the middle. This prevents piles of grass from building up. Consumer Reports tests ride-on mowers from Cub Cadets to Husqvarna's and Toros. So for more buying advice, ratings, and recommendations, check out Consumer Reports' website.